praise the Lord. Amen. Yes, my people, as you the heart, it don't happen though. Peter will be waiting the apple self. You do the do. Ah! Now, now, see, small thing you boom one of us, they laugh now. You don't put your mouth on it. And this shit, you my friend talk, oh, you send out Peter, I'll be the joker. Now, who call me joker now? You don't push your thing you boom one for internet. You don't put your hands up, 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 you don't put your hands up. He got one virus when Peter B the share give all the presidential candidates and I go expose Peter B to that go talk the virus name. <laughs> the virus and they call Obidati Apartation. He don't even push all the presidential candidates. <laughs> now, now, to so call add salt during the injury now, he don't go meet with the pastor of Salvation Ministry, Pastor David Abiyome. Now, he don't add more apartation to that body now. <laughs> My mother family, me cannot talk too much. I don't know, don't push up for internet now. So if you be shady, man, me not talk too much. Me cannot share this video and me cannot comment on our opinion for the comment section and on the WhatsApp. Joker, he don't push up no be joker come up for internet. Nah, nah, I'm gonna miss something like blah blah boo, boo blah blah boo. I beg, Tinubu, I beg, come back. Me cannot talk Tinubu say I beg. Make you not come up for internet, I beg we go miss him. We don't, uh -uh. If you don't come out, who not going to make us they laugh? So, the Bible says, give honor to whom honor is due while we're in service. <laughs> Praise the Lord. You're, you're, you're all wanting to hear from me. To give whom honor is due. It's scriptural. It was one time governor of Anambra State. And then... It's not a presidential kind of Labour Party. It's here to worship with us in this first service. Who was in the service? His Excellency Peter B is in this service. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. God is faithful. Okay. I saw another politician that today. <laughs> well, we just we, we will introduce them. I did Magnus Abbey is here with the God bless you. Amen. God bless you. Amen. It's a church. So whoever comes will introduce. It's a church. Praise God. We have all whoever comes. We introduce, but God bless you. But Nigeria will get better. Amen. Nigeria, how rise to close? <laughs> Praise the Lord. Well, let me say this to you: You as a believer, go and get your voters card. Because if you want to select whoever will rule you tomorrow, I don't have a voters card. You don't have a voice. So whoever you want to choose is your own. I'm not a politician. I will never be one till Jesus comes. But your voters card matters. Enough. Don't say you want to choose leaders and they don't have a voters card. While we pray, you also do the practicals. Anybody want to vote? It's not my business. That's your own business. You are free to vote whoever you want to vote. But make sure you look for a visionary leader. That's my own prayer for you. So that tomorrow you won't start regretting the steps you've taken. Make sure you see ahead. See far. And God bless you. On the 26th and the 7th of my life, I can let go. I can't let you wear number one. I want to get Christ for help. I can go on and on and say this is what we did. But I said, your overall measure is MDG. I was number one. The people who were doing it there was Amina, who is now in the United Nations. I was even invited to the United Nations to share my experience. And so many of them alone. And collectively, the day I left office, I was not owing any contractor who have executed this job. I think they are not owing for any job that I don't have been awarded. But you can only pay when job is executed. I'm not owing any contractor who have executed this job. I'm not owing any supplier who has supplied anything. I'm not owing one. 
examples are people like Innocent, Xenox computer, iPad Xenox. We bought the highest amount of computer ever bought by a government in Africa. They are there. HP will tell you the same thing. I paid them six months up front before they supplied it to our schools. I paid it also one year before they delivered any car. You can go this is an exam test, so you can go and respire me. Above this, I decided from day one that we must have a savings as a as a state. And we must save at least ten percent of my total receipt. By time I left by time I'll leave government. Total money I received. While I was governor, and I'm proud to receive whether it's local government, whether it's state, in whether it's in, uh, our local um, revenue, IGR, everything was about 500 and something billion naira. Out of which they are left office, we had in savings 75 billion naira. And this is how the money was shared, so that you know which one is mentioned. Only one that is bad. The money we save is A, we save in dollar. In three banks in Nigeria, some of you are working in those banks. Access Bank, Diamond Bank, and Fidelity Bank. In each of these banks, I had a saving of $50 million. Dollars, this same money. And they were invested at, a, at, at least interest of six and a half percent. If you calculate it today, as at that time, it was a growth of 25 billion, because our 150, something 150. If you calculate today with interest, it's about 250, at least 250 million dollars. These three banks are there. I have in each of these banks, again invested at least 30 billion, there's a 10 billion naira, in three of them, making it 30 billion, and an average interest, call it even 10 percent. If you calculate it, that money today would have been about 60 billion. Remember what I left is 75 as we calculated them. So then the third, the third one is investment that is in various companies. NIPP, we have 59 million dollars in it. The one that they say is one less is that we invested 3.5 billion in international breweries. International breweries is a, what you can call a global company. It's a part of Airbnb, which is the biggest brewer in the whole world. We, have a, we had a policy while I was governor that any factor, anybody who wants to, foreign investor who wants to invest in Anambra State, who will buy 10% of the company and under the condition that we sign an agreement with him that he will give our number of people work to the minimum of not than 40 percent of the workers they build their facility in our state that facility is there today employing directly and indirectly over 10,000 and embryos they are one of the highest revenue source for the state even with some of their waste, the biggest bakery we have in Anambra State collects waste from them. There's so many things that company has done in terms of helping the state, transporters, this, that, and everything. The shares was at the time being sold at 50 naira. Today the shares is about 5 naira or so. And then maybe that was what was referred. But in overall of what I left, is less than five percent. Okay. That particular investment is less than five percent. So if you calculate what I have left, I left seventy-five billion. If you go and sell the dollars today, even at six hundred, it's one fifty billion. Plus sixty billion of the naira is two hundred and ten billion. Even if that one is wasted, three times what I invested is still there. When you spread your investment, some will go up, some will come down. But overall. The company is still there, the company is still doing well, it's still part of a global chain and everything. I need to explain it not because I'm defending comment by my brother. My brother is the brother, I miss my brother, we're very close, I remain grateful for him. Of other things which I didn't succeed, God has given him opportunity 
Je lui donne ceci. Amis. Amis. Yes. So if there's anything pending, no more lawsuits. No more lawsuits. Don't finish. People are still the government in America. So you stop where you stop. Other people will continue from there. I don't look back. It's the governor of my state. I'm always with my senior brother. Even more intelligent because he's a professor and a trader. So you not know. So you be able to do things better than I'm doing. You know, I got my little one as a trader. Now the professor is there. He will do his own as a professor. The schools that need roof, you roof them. That's how government goes. Another person comes, do his own. But let us think about. Finally, like I tell you before, for those of you who are, please get involved. All of us are going to tell you a good story. All of us are going to say the same thing. Like, but it's who can we trust? Even in this one they are talking about me. Some said he kept on your indifference. I said, uh, even in the Bible, the man said, since you know enough, why did you give my money for seven? Even everybody who has passed through Nigeria, who did nothing, kept money. Are we going to be in problem now? We don't have the money to do something. At least I kept the money. But in this one, I did something and I have the money. Next year's election, please, I'm begging all of you, should not be based on ethnicity. Don't ever do it. You don't ever have buy bread cheaper. Neither do our stars. Or not gonna buy bread cheaper. The southwest people don't buy bread cheaper. He was not buy bread cheaper. Let nobody tell you about this. This is everybody suffering. Do not do it because of religion. No religion buys anything cheaper. No, there's no 